We're talking about fat grafting and how uh, facial rejuvenation has been changed by that. People age in three broad categories. When I sit with patients in consultation, I say the surface of our skin is aging. We're getting age spots, broken blood vessels, wrinkles. Those problems are treated with skin care, laser resurfacing. The second category of aging is things sagging, drooping, becoming loose, redundant. That's where our traditional surgical lifts of the forehead, eyes, face, neck come in. The third category of aging is medically known as atrophy, a word that means shrinkage or hollowing that we were leaving untreated. And fat grafting has become our way of treating that third component, allow us to treat the aging change more comprehensively, create a softer, more natural, healthy looking face as opposed to a, a lifted tight one. It's a graft of, the, of your own tissue, it doesn't come from another patient. And I think historically fat was bad. All fat was bad, patients wanted it removed, surgeons were actually mistakenly removing it in some cases. And we've come to realize that the young face is plushly padded and soft um, and not gaunt and hard uh, or ill-appearing.